What's up guys, welcome to 254 Celebrity Channel. If you're new here, feel free to like, comment and subscribe. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for the support. And without further ado, let's get right into the tea. So this past Saturday was a really big day for new Wasafi Records signee who goes by the name Zuchu. And it was her EP launch date and Diamond Platinum's being the CEO of Wasafi Records threw her a huge event dubbed I am Zuchu Asante Nashukuru. The event was held at Milimani City in Dar es Salaam and the people who were in attendance were of course the WCB team which consists of Revani, Mboso, Queen Darling, Lava Lava and there were also some huge celebrities from Tanzania that attended. Nana Kwambia it was all about glitz and glamour from the costumes to the rides they pulled up to the event in hey, everything was so popping me i think somebody needs to take our kenyan celebrities benchmarking <laughs> in tanzania because we never see such kind of effort pulled by our celebs when it comes to red carpet events anyway there were two particular guests that had diamonds fans super excited and i'm talking about hamisa mobeto and wema sepetu and this is because the both women share history with diamond for Hamisa Mobeto, she is one of Diamond's baby mamas and Zari's arch enemy. Because as we all know, back when Diamond and Zari used to date, Hamisa was the side chick. <laughs> so it's pretty clear that Zari does not F with Hamisa at all. Even from the sneak dissing she does once in a while on her IG. And I'm not really sure how she felt watching this video of Hamisa and Diamond dancing. Amisa even managed to like sneak a grind in there and Zari <laughs> knowing that she's reconnecting with Diamond right now and he's even topping up money for her to buy cars. She must have been salty AF. <laughs> but then again, that's just my assumption. So fans of Zari, please don't come for me. <laughs> there was also this video of Wema Sepetu and Diamond dancing that was making rounds on the internet. And to be honest, I feel like these two still have the connection they had back then, you know. I'm not sure if Wema was Diamond's first love, but she was Diamond's first public girlfriend. And Wema was with Diamond even when he had nothing. Akiwa ameparara bila kakitu. So Diamond must have really loved Wema. And it's also clear that Wema still has some love for Diamond. You can even peep from the way she's eyeing Diamond. <laughs> I'm not reaching guys, it's all in the video. Anyway, it seems that Diamond is out here trying to bury the hatchet by reconnecting with his old flames. The other day we saw him reconnect with Zari and even topped up money for her to buy that Bentley. He also showed support to Hamisa by letting her dress him for this whole event because Hamisa owns a fashion house. So that's really nice. Let's just wait and see whether he's going to come through for our girl Tanasha. Diamond, you better start paying that child support because Tanasha Alisema homeside young. Mm, what do you mean supporting financially? Well, financially, or? definitely. He's a father and uh, he has to man up. And, uh, <laughs> uh, and uh, No, I've been doing it all on my own, to be honest. And also the next time she has an EP lounge, you better attend. Usimruke vile ulimfanyia, please. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's all for now. Like this video, comment your thoughts, and subscribe for more updates. And until next time, bye!